we are back. So this video is going to be, it's going to start off a bit different. I'm going to react to the Gold Saucer date scenes. Um, and then we're going to jump into the game. So this is a video from IGN. Uh, one second. So it's about, it's like half an hour. So it's a lot of content, actually. Um, a lot of effort that they clearly put into this part of the game, which is really cool. Um, yeah, so I really want to know what these other scenes are. So we're going to react to this and then we'll get the game going. So let's see what happens. So we're going to start off with Aerith's date and then it seems like there's intimate parts of the date. Um, <laughs> I don't want to like spoil it with with thumbnails, but um, yeah, it seems like if you have maybe a high enough relationship with some of the characters, then you get a special moment. I'm curious if I got Red's intimate scene. <laughs> so anyway, let's watch. Hurry up! Aerith is the one that I okay. Thought I wanted, so, so let's see. Shall we? <sighs> the music, dude. Oh. Uh. <sighs> what do you think this does? Seems nothing like that. Well, you would know. <laughs> it's all so much. Isn't it? You surprised me at first. You were just like him, and... It wasn't your face or your clothes. It was you. The way you walked. The way you carried yourself. Whenever I looked at you, I saw him. But you're not him. And that's okay. Because right now, I want to be with you. And I'm trying so hard to find you. But I'm right here. Yeah, you are. But... Hey. Did Tifa talk to you? About, um... Hey, um, Aerith? I talked to Cloud. He said he remembers Zack. How they were friends five years ago. What? I don't think so. At least, not about anything important. Oh. Earth. 
Just till the ride's over. How about that, eh? Oh! Oh! I love that Cloud has no shirt on, by the way. <laughs> That's precious. Out of here, I'm crying. <laughs> hey, thanks for tonight. You're welcome, but I didn't do anything. <laughs> well, market warriors, you and me. We'll show him tomorrow. <laughs> Hell yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay, obviously that was so precious. Um, I had a thought, but it's gone, I think. <laughs> I think it's gone. <laughs> so the intimate part comes at the end, yeah, where... Oh, Cloud holds her hand, so cute. Um... Yeah, super interesting about... Well, obviously, they did talk about Zack. But there's more that... Tifa knows that Cloud doesn't know about Nibelheim and all that, so they're still, like, not really confronting him. Um, yeah. I had another thought, but it's gone. Are we really doing this? <laughs> Could use some peace and quiet, couldn't you? Come on. <sighs> What's this? I would think it's just the table, to be honest, but they all clue in that it's like a device. Dude. I wouldn't be able to handle that spin. Get down! Hey! <laughs> you trying to break it? Just messing with you. It's a cool gun. I don't think I have that one. sweet girl named Myrna. Knew right away she was the one. But Myrna, she wasn't buying what I was selling. Told me she was in the market for a man, not a selfish little boy. If I was gonna win her heart, I had some growing up to do. Otherwise, she'd never give me the time of day. Funny enough, our first date was at a theme park. Nowhere near as big as this place, of course. Just a traveling fair with a handful of rides. 
We ended up riding these wooden chocobos round and round, laughing our asses off. <laughs> Look at me, boring you with my old stories. Wouldn't be the first time. Don't worry, I'm used to it. <sighs> yeah, well, the lesson here is once you find your soulmate, you never let him go. Although seeing it just stuck right in this thing with me, I'm thinking you probably already <laughs> did. Hey, you invited me. <laughs> right, because I learned to make the first move, which is exactly what you gotta do. Duly noted. <laughs> Lesson here is once you find your soulmate, you never let him go. So, who is it? <laughs> hmm? Who's what? You know damn well what I'm talking about. Why do you always have to overthink things? That ain't no way to live. You gotta just go for it sometimes. You mean like you do all the time? Hmm. Do say. You could say that we balance each other out. Yeah. <laughs> I mean it, though. If you do have feelings for someone, tell them straight out. Don't wait till it's too late. Right. Okay, good advice from Barrett. It's very cute. Thanks Loved hearing more about tonight. his wife, too. I appreciate it. Tomorrow, we're gonna go to town on those suckers. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, so we've seen reds. But I want to see if the intimate moment is the one I got. I think it is. Where we shake Paul. I don't remember what's supposed to happen, but I do know she's in danger. Shake. What? Shake on it. <laughs> they are soft. Huh? <laughs> Nothing. Forget it. I like that part. That's so cute. Also in mine, um, Cloud was wearing his default outfit and he had his gloves on, and so it kind of didn't make sense that he was able to feel red spots. I'm glad that we could but speak here it in does. private, Cloud. Yeah. Okay, so next is Tifa. You ready for this? A gondola's here. Well, after you. You first. Oh. Uh, Cloud? Think we can steer with this? Worth a try. <laughs> Here it goes. Save. 
<laughs> I love Tifa so much. Hey, over there! See that? looks so fun that's definitely not what the races are like I guess I'll just have to see for myself They were friends five years ago. What? Not yet. Right. Touchy subject, huh? She must still have feelings for Zack. I think it's a little more complicated than that. <laughs> It's really complicated. <laughs> hey, it's kind of weird us being here like this, isn't it? Is it? I mean, I guess it is. Kind of. Ever since we left Midgar on this crazy journey, ever since we were kids even, I can't remember a time like this. A time when we were this close. Or am I getting ahead of myself again? Again? Yeah. Again. Not one bit. Oh my god, it gets even more- oh my god. Cloud, so sweet. We should probably head back to our rooms. Yeah, probably. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. Have we ever seen... No, in any Final Fantasy VII medium. We have never seen anything like that, am I right? That blows my mind!
That fucking blows my mind! Holy shit! <laughs> okay, so it's official. Cloud and Tifa. That's the canon. <laughs> oh my god. I cannot believe that. They actually fucking did it. They did it! <laughs> wow! Oh my god, and he's the one who, um, like, pulls her in. Even in the normal, like, not intimate one. He pulls her in for a hug, even, like... That's the most we've seen from Cloud. Like, even in Aerith's, she was the one who, like, snuggled up to him. So I think we're seeing something about Cloud in that a lot. Him reaching out to Tifa. Oh my god! <gasps> I'm in shock! I think the fandom is in shock. Holy shit, well, okay, let's recover <laughs> with a Practice funny Yuffie perfect. date. <laughs> Practice Whoa. for what? Uh, for when the real thing comes around. <laughs> Wait, what is she talking about? <laughs> hey, aren't you forgetting someone? You mean like a practice date for when her real love oh, comes? Is that what she means? Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Okay, Miss Motion Sickness. <laughs> That's so cool! God, I still can't believe that, man. <laughs> Nothing's gonna top that, right? There's no way he's kissing Yuffie. That's not canon. <laughs> <laughs> I was waiting for that. Uh, let's take a break. Uh, Great idea. Yeah, yeah. Tifa go way back. Yeah. I also heard she used to have a pretty big crush on you. That's so. Oh, well, not at first. Apparently, even as a kid, you had that weird loner vibe. But then one day, bam! She caught the love bug! Were you into her? Don't remember. I guess that makes sense. Tifa said she was so busy after the move to Midgard that she forgot all about you, too. Don't know what it is about you guys, but I get it. I had a thing for a soldier once. At least I think he was a soldier. I wanted to prove myself, so I hit him with my best moves. <laughs> Was like I was firing energy blasts. After a few salvos, he shouted, You got me! And at the time, I totally bought it. Of course, he was just playing along for a dumb kid. And once I realized that, I was pissed. 
I couldn't stop thinking about him. <laughs> I swore to myself that one day I'd blast that jerk for real. Did some hardcore training so I could give him a beat down. But eventually, it dawned on me. He was just being nice. Like, he was a really nice I guy. I don't know who she's talking about, by the way. And the more I thought about it, the more I realized... Wow. I liked him. You know? Maybe it's because of those feelings that I still can't fire energy blasts. I can help. Uh... With the energy blast? <laughs> or my feelings? The former. Feelings ain't my thing. <sighs> I think we both kind of suck in that department. Situations. It was just practice. <laughs> it was practice. So, so don't go thinking it means anything, okay? Wait, she kissed him? I couldn't tell if she kissed him or whispered. I'm guessing it was a kiss. <laughs> oh, say something! Something. Are you kidding me? I do something nice for you and that's what I get? <laughs> you lousy jerk! <laughs> Okay. Oh, say something! <sighs> You're so annoying! that guy again this is so what different than tifa's that's up to you but if it were me i'd let him have it <laughs> <laughs> good job cloud that's cute i like that like she thinks it's a practice date um oh it's not over i like it tell anyone about tonight and you're a dead man <laughs> <laughs> okay, bye, Yuffie. That's super cute. That's very Yuffie. Kate said Sid and Vincent. <laughs> no, he was flying to me. It doesn't he work like that? This is if you really mess up and you don't do any side quests and you say all the wrong things. Oh, but this could be fun though. I would have fun here. Minus Kate Sid. But we just sit here and spin? Ugh. Could at least thrown in a joystick. That seems joysticky. Oh. <laughs> Some dumb kids toy. <laughs> Come on. At least we can enjoy the scenery. Just look. You've got a space battle unfolding right before your very eyes. Tell me that doesn't send a chill down your spine. Oh, no! Evasive action! Hard to port! <laughs> Whoa! Made it by the skin of our teeth! Kate <laughs> hmm? oh. you must have seen this like a thousand oh. times at your job, right? <laughs> You know, people sometimes ask me to predict who will win a race. Ah, come off it, I tell them. If I could do that, I wouldn't they still be working here now, would I? Hmm? Huh? 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 Whoa! Oh, it's looking! <laughs> Except for Casey. Whoa! Talk about a breathtaking spectacle! Seriously, are you allowed seeing this? Oh. No. Oh. <laughs> to hell with you, you wee scunners! 
barbarians. I provide entertainment in spades, and all I get is crickets. Can we go any faster? This is torture. And how do you think I feel? Hey, <laughs> zip it. Why are you taking his side? I'm the one trying to make this fun. Yeah, shut up, dude. <laughs> are you sleeping? <laughs> Oh Open my the God. doors! Let me open this thing! <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's <t> Wait, <laughs> I'll be in the stands rooting for you tomorrow. Knock him dead. I'm trying not to let it finish right to the end because I don't want to see the related videos. <laughs> Wait. If you like okay, that. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, I don't even want to minimize it because I don't want to see the the fucking related videos in the sidebar. Okay, so that was really fucking worth watching. I'm still reeling about Cloud and Tifa. Holy moly. There's no more debate now. Cloud and Tifa. It's canon. <laughs> Damn, I love that that is what they did because his relationship is so different with Tifa versus Aerith, like. And yeah, obviously Aerith's relationship with Zack is like kind of, you know, a thing that is obviously hard to navigate. And I think it was a good choice. I think it was a good choice. Really good choice. <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to load up the game now and then we can continue. So, one second. I'm back. It's been a few hours, um, which was unforeseen. <laughs> I went to start the game and I think it tried to install an update. And the update for some reason didn't install properly and I couldn't launch the game. And I looked up the error code and the only way to fix it was to uninstall the game and reinstall it. <laughs> so I did that and it's a very big game. It's like 150 gigs. So it took a while and I was worried, like I'm not familiar with, well in, until today, I wasn't familiar with where on the PS5 your save data was versus the game data. And so I was panicking about losing my save data, which would be fucking insane. Um, but it, it's they're, they're stored in different places. So it all worked out. The game is installed again, updated. We're fine. <laughs> but it was a little bit nerve wracking, even though Google told me it would be fine. <laughs> so. Anyway, we're back. And we were doing this quest, which we'll finish. Um, where we're trying to find the sandworm, I think. And I was honestly getting a little bored of it. So I looked up where to go. <laughs> And it's like right around here. So we're gonna go there because I wanna get on with my life, you know? Also, for the Queen's Blood game, I'm looking into strategies for that. And I think I found one. I need to check the cards I have. But I have a strategy for that. I don't like looking at guides, but for that, I just want to do it and get to the end of the game. So, yeah. Do I have to get. I have to probably take out that thing, hey? around here. One of the most 
most hated enemies in the game are these worms. It's a big one. I don't know if I've fought this type of thing before. Giga Worm. No. I got your number. Got your number. Crippling its stomach after it swallows a rock will pressure it, and it's weak to Blizzard. Okay. Alright, I think this guy's gonna be annoying. If it's anything like the other worms. Can I hit its mouth, actually? No. Sorry, crippling its stomach after it swallows a rock. Alright, he's gonna do his swallow thing, roll towards him. And we can't get fucked by that. Alright, he's gonna do it again. We do it to No, we're okay. Sorry, here goes! I'm gonna do something with this tail. No, okay. That's a big move. Fucking awesome. Check out this shit right here. Check out this shit right here. I'm Ooh, shit, together. he got him. Need my help, do you? Yeah, I can't hit his stomach anymore. It's too bad. Well, I can. Hang back. Red. Red's back. Um. We're gonna get it. Braver. No, let's do infinity infinite infinity then. Red, get in there. Whoa! Loud. Nice. <laughs> Quite a performance. I'm impressed. As you should be. Oh, where are you off to now? Unfortunately, Shen has been making moves to push back against the resistance efforts. Once they tighten up the borders, travel's gonna get tough. So, I've decided to head for Wu Tai while I can. Wu Tai. You're going home too. It's gonna be in the third you? game. I think we know that. No, not yet. Well, at this point, if we went to Wu Tai, it would be kind of weird. Not until I've gathered lots and lots of powerful materia. I see. Well, I'm trying to stay out of trouble. That goes for the rest of you as well. You're bound to get caught up and better be prepared. Right. Magnified. Nice. Nice seeing you. Good luck out there. See you back See in, you in game time. three. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what it means when she has the little speech bubble. Um. Okay, so... Notice board. Okay, it didn't spawn any new quests, so... Oops. Fuck. Okay. Cosmo Canyon is done. Pharrell, we had that quest to kill the Jabberwock and the Malboro. Which I could do. Um, Let me look at my Queen's Blood cards and see if we have the cards for this particular strategy I'm looking at. It's kind of, it's, what I would think the strategy would be is to, like, use the same abilities that the Blood Queen uh, uses. So whenever you enfeeble, like, enfeeble as many things as possible, um, but have those cards that benefit from that be in the top row or the bottom row. 
because the queen makes it basically so that you it's really hard to take the middle row. So if you can just take the top two rows using cards that can get, you know, as half half as strong as her, but split up over two rows, then then you can do it. So I'm just gonna Okay, security officer, we got him, obviously. Crawler. I wish I had the card numbers here. Um do 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 do. We got a crawler. Rictus, that is the key. We have Rictus. Chimera. Now that card I don't think we're seeing in here. Oh, it's here. Okay, we got nice. Uh adju fuck. Adju Adjudicator. Why is it always so hard for me to say that word? Uh ad ad Adjudicator. I've never had trouble saying that word till now. If you've seen John Wick, you know the adjudicator is in that movie. Now, I don't think I have that card. Insectoid Chimera? We may have to do a little bit of work. We have the Diabolic Variant. Okay, there's also another card we definitely don't have. Oh, we have Insectoid card, Chimera. Uh, I'm not seeing a Adjudicator. Uh, well, what does Adjudicator do? God, I hate Googling things. I'm going into like a private window because I don't my, want my search history to fucking... I don't want any fucking spoilers. Looking up the date scenes, I already got something spoiled. Oh no, sorry, not the date scenes, but the Queen's Blood strategy. I got spoiled how many chapters are in the game, which I didn't want to know. Um, which is too bad. So yeah, so okay, Adjudicador. Wait, we should have that because we got all the fucking booster packs, right? Unless there's another one I didn't buy. Okay, I'm not seeing it. Let's um get this deck going. So again, I don't love doing this, but also I don't want to spend tons and tons of time coming up with my own strategies. So like, yeah, anyway. Okay, Adjudicator. Don't have it, I don't think. I need to check. Insectoid, Chimera, Diabolic Variant. And there's something called Kells Melzer. <laughs> Oops. So let's see. I know this isn't super fun to watch. Kells Melzer. We got we got another booster pack to buy, I think. That's also in a booster pack. Where Uh, I hate looking at wikis. Don't look at anything except for the column of interest. It doesn't tell me what region to buy it in. It just says buy the booster pack in the region that where it is. <laughs> Wait, it's available post game. God, I hate reading this. I'm like trying to squint. You have to complete the main story before you get it. Well then. We're in chapter 12 now, so we can buy the Adjudicator card. 
Thank you. Costa del Sol. That's where that one is. So <laughs> let's save that deck for what it is. Get on out of here. Yeah, this is my... Ugh, we'll see. We'll see about that one. We'll see about that one. I might save that till later. Or never. The best way to make tracks is on Choco Bag. <laughs> Anything can happen. I'm on the hunt for new love, baby. Grab a material pop and give your I think it should be sold here. Welcome. Yeah, okay. Oh my god, that's awesome. Look, they put Reno on the front. Okay, there's the adjudicator. So Thanks let me just see by. if I need this Kel Melzer. <laughs> Kel's Melzer card. Uh, replace an ally and lower the power of allied... Okay, so maybe I can get away without that one. It's got a cool pattern. Replace an ally and lower the power of, of allied and enemy cards. Okay, let's see. We can, we can approximate that card. I don't think it has to be exact. Obviously, there's more than one way. Look at it. They got cool uh, formations. Whoa, whoa. When first enhanced, lower the power of allied and enemy cards on effect shots by 99. Why not just say destroy it? <laughs> uh, okay, adjudicate it. There you are. Wait, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, oh, one diabolical variant. Diabolic variant. I mean, that can be one of my cards that replaces it, I think. <clears throat> Hell's Melzer. Such a weird word. They have some really weird words in this game, like... The, the amount of times I stumble through some words in dialogue is quite often. Alright, let's just um, put in another card maybe that... See here, this makes sense because you can... If I'm playing top and bottom row, this card is good for getting lowering the middle row. So I want something like that. Maybe bat. Yeah, something like this. Let's try it. Okay, so let's head over where she is. See if we can do this. Passing through. Passing through. 
So let me just see. Let me just read this strategy once more. So this is just one person's, you know, strategy for how to do this. The key to winning is getting a Chimera and either an Adjudicator or Rictus in two of the lanes. Yeah, and it's so getting top and bottom lanes is the easiest. Your starting hand should ideally have a... Let's get into it and then... Stake your life. I hope, like, Regina's okay after this, by the way. Your starting hand ideally should have a security officer and a crawler. Play the security officer... Okay. So Rictus, raise power by- yes, that's the key. Adjudicator is the same. So if you can get both in the top and bottom, it's probably- it still might be difficult. Because Yeah. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Um... Oh, and what was the Chimeras again? Chimera... Yeah, raise power by two, okay. So Chimera is obviously the best. Rictus is... Yeah, these are twos. It's only by one. So Chimera is like the power play. Okay, so let me just read this out loud so I can start to absorb it. Your starting hand should ideally have a security officer and a crawler. Play the security officer in the first column of the second row, followed by a crawler in the second column of the second row. That should give you the ability to play the top and bottom lanes of... of... okay, without too much issue. Drop a Rictus Chimera or Adjudicator in the first or third row of the second column. You don't want to fill the first column yet. Okay, why not? Part of the struggle is that because of how the board is set up and the cards she has, the Shadowblood Queen could flip spaces pretty easily. Yes. As such, you'll want to use Insectoid Chimera or Kelzmelzer to fill the space in the second column back to you if she takes one of them. Um. Well... I don't have that card. Oh, it- but this- right. That is a replacement card, I didn't even realize that. Okay, good. You'll want to use Insectoid Chimera or Kel Melzer to flip the spaces in the second column back to you if she takes one of them. Okay. If you're able to get any spaces in the third column, that's even better. But it's difficult to do. So once you've got a Chimera and or Adjudicator and Rictus in two of the lanes, you're very likely to win those lanes. Yes, because the enfeebling blah blah blah. Alright, I think that's basically it. So well, I'll have to read that probably a bit more, but we can start to try this. Okay. So this might go a bit slow because I, I'm trying to follow this strategy. So we wanted a security officer and a crawler. We got the crawler. So I'm gonna... put these two back. And maybe one more, actually.
No, we're good. Okay, so we didn't get the security officer. Does he do the same sort of thing? Yes, but he enfeebles, which is not great. Um... So that's not a good start, not a good start. But let's see how this goes. Well, we want to get the Chimera down. And right now it's looking like Adjudicator in the bottom. I really need to uh, spread out. This is better than that Adjudicator. Okay, security officer. Um, he will die, but hopefully uh, we can place shit. Let's try it. Oh, I can't even place him? There's something I'm not getting about that. If, I, if he's gonna die, I've placed cards that immediately die before. Why can't I place? Oh, there's no pip there. Okay. Well. We could enfeeble our own cards. But they will go up in power. Oh, I'm not spreading there. No, 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 no. Okay, that's not what we want. Okay, we want this. Maybe that was stupid. Okay, security officer. Boom. He'll die, but... Okay, this is working pretty well. I can see this working pretty well. Um, let's play an adjudicator here. Yeah, I'm not spreading too well at all. Probably because my starting hand was a little shitty. Okay, we still have one. Okay, we got a crawler. That's pretty good. He'll die. That's okay. Okay. Now, I want to take... Well, we got a Rictus, too. Wow, Adjudicator starts at 9? I just realized that. Fuck. Um, I'm gonna... I think I can hold that square. So I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do that. Okay. This is going very well. Wait a minute. What is this Adjudicator? Oh, I see. Oh, I'm dumb. It doesn't start at 9. Yeah, okay. Let's do that. <laughs> okay, this is going good. This is going great. And let's play... Um... I think this is in my favor here to do this. I think it very much... Oh no, but she gets points if I enfeeble also. That's the key. So we're just gonna place a little Rictus there. Okay, that strat was really great. Thank you, internet. Thank you to uh, the Escapist article by Liam Nolan. Worked very well, thank you, sir. What foul sorcery! What?! A cursed witch! Even in death, you would thwart me! 
Okay, good. good. What about... She's gone. Oh, she is, is she? <laughs> Be still, little puppet. You belong to me now. <laughs> Oh fuck yeah, dude. Use the card. Don't you dare. Game oh. over. Oh, look at that. That's so cool. <laughs> Neutralized. <laughs> oh. Okay, good. Okay, good. Thank you, Cloud. For stopping her. For stopping me. Guess I really let all that genius crap go to my head, huh? After a while, losing became my worst nightmare. I'd do anything to win, and look where it got me. You are not to blame for this. Evil like that preys on our deepest, darkest fears and worms its way into our hearts. Few ever break free. You're the best because you worked your ass off, not because you're a genius. Got it? <sighs> got it. <sighs> well, on that note, I'd better get back to it. After all, there can only be one card queen. <laughs> <laughs> so next time you want to throw down, you best come prepared. Right. <laughs> Later! All's well that ends well, I suppose. Thanks to you. <laughs> Couldn't have you dying on me just yet. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about having that card still, even though she's dead. Blood champion. Nice. Okay. That's really cool. That strategy worked extremely well. Okay, so we just have this one quest in Corel region. I really just don't want to do it. <laughs> but it's only one more quest. I also need those- okay, so pearl- okay, let me- let me look. I know we need the two good items. We have plenty of the other things, okay. Well... The Jabberwock... was in Col- uh, Grasslands. Malboro was in Gongaga. Why don't we go do it? It's the last one. Great, Malbora was this thing, right? Yes. And what was he weak to again? I think it was Blizzard. And we need to hit his mouth when he does that disgusting belch thing. Goddamn, we're getting really close to the end of the game. And I don't want it to be over. I think it's ice. 
pretty sure it's not lightning. It could be maybe fire, but pretty sure it's ice. Oh, Comet. I haven't used Comet at all. Let's guess replace that for now with ice. Pretty sure it's ice. We do fire and ice. Let's do fire and ice. But you have fire as well. Eh. Um. Who has Comet? It must be Aerith. We don't have it equipped. Okay, let's put it. Uh. Okay, we're still working on our weapons. I haven't been paying attention to that. And I don't like wasting items, so I'm gonna save. I remember this was tricky, but we're also a higher level now, so we'll see. Such a cool looking enemy. Oh, I didn't heal, man. Deal with that. Okay, it's ice staggering their mouth. And for some reason, the fact that it says they is making me laugh. <laughs> like the Malboro has pronouns <laughs> that it prefers. <laughs> okay, anyway. Um, shattering their mouth will make them sup with staggering and prevent them from using bad breath. Okay. Um, I really need to heal because I'm dumb. There's, can I? Oh yeah, it takes a second. Takes a second. Rank mouth. I love that. Oh. Let's use our um, blizzard on him. Oh, he's asleep and he's a frog. Fuck. <laughs> I might use like a really good item. Like Mist Mega Potion. Let's do it. God damn it. That's not good. Okay, back to Barrett. No, Red, you're close, you're close. No! Forgot already. Uh-oh. Now I remember why I hated this guy so much. Wait, where did where did Red go? Is he in there? Ain't dead yet. I don't know he could Oh god, don't go in that. I think we can Where is Red? Garrett's being poisoned. Fuck, he's moving fast. Uh Be careful. I wonder if he's. Beaded <laughs> mouth now. Okay, we're fucked. We are fucked now. Where is Red? Where the fuck is red, actually? I have no clue. Like. It's my time. 
I don't know where red was. Oh, it doesn't... Okay, if I just do that, it won't use items. <laughs> um... Well, we can keep trying. We've done it before. I really need to heal before I even attempt this. <laughs> And then we really need to be ready to attack his mouth. But I don't want to turn into a frog, so like... I should... I should use Blizzard from a distance. When he... When I can hit his mouth. Not be up on his mouth getting turned into a frog. unfrog right now I'm still sleeping though which is almost as bad but I must have something that yeah I think I do Wake the fuck up. Rally someone from a stupor? Oh, there you go. Fight. We got clouds. Okay, thank god. Still need to do the same for red, but also I need to be ready need a breather. for that mouth. Don't walk in that. Okay, bad breath is coming. Um, Red's still asleep. But I'm gonna be. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here's what's gonna happen. Great. Barret, you're gonna quickly unsleep Red. Oh, he's almost awake. I think we're okay. Fuck, I can't cast his, uh, cloud. Alright. Um, here we go. I'm in, let's switch it up. It's a frog, god damn it. Need to heal up. Okay, we have to get our friends. Red's almost up. No, he's not. Yeah, he is. Barret's not. <sighs> and he's a frog, though. Oh, not this shit. Okay, this is where we gotta really fucking kill this fuck, because... Okay, Barret's gonna unfrog himself. And now I'm gonna start taking a lot more damage. So we're gonna blizzard him. Fuck, I'm still silent. Okay, uh. He's moving. Gotcha. 
Okay. Good. We need to we need to get him. We need to get him. We're gonna do this. No, we're not. I'm just gonna fucking. Victory is all but guaranteed. I'm up for anything. Ooh, gotta love it. Check out this shit right here. We can do it. Alright. We got the tentacle. Nice. Okay. Let's make sure that that's correct. Oh, we're stuck in... Here we go. Jabberwock Horn. So we're gonna go back to Grasslands. Nope. Grasslands? And I think it was... this? Was it that? Oh, it's in Cosmo Canyon. Okay, okay. What was this guy? Was it the zoo? Jabberwock. Oh, he was the guy in the cave. This one. This one, this one, this one. Yeah. So let's, um, go somewhere and heal. Jabberwock, I don't remember much about him, his weaknesses. I don't remember the fight being as bad as the Malboro. Oops. Hello? God, I fucked up. Here we go. Did I not? Fire. Okay. So I need to wait for Gorgon Shield. All right. Keep it together. Okay, that's a frontal attack. A spell, please. Um, fuck, he's like, I'll use this, why not? Sure, why not? God, he's got some crazy shield up now. But it's not a. It's not a status. 
abilities here. Okay, let's create this bait. Oh, we're stuck here. Nope. There we go. We made the bait. Let's go to the beach. The secret beach. Wait, where am I? Up here. Woo! We're getting there. I also forgot about the proto-relic thing here. I might do that before going to the temple. I don't know yet. So what is this gonna- what kind of enemy is this gonna be? It's something cool. Some legend. This bait's a bust. <laughs> oh, sea devil? Still too soon. Double sea devil. <laughs> I've definitely not assessed you yet. Woo! Look at him. Best do it right. Ice. Exploiting their elemental weakness will pressure them. Inflicting a certain amount of lightning damage will cause them to attack less frequently. Oh, okay. Ooh, that'll be good. They look a little bit mobile to me. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Run. No! Um... Cloud out of there. Fuck. 
Okay, he's coming for red. Damn it! I was hoping he would stop running. Okay. Okay, great. Oh, let's hold off for a second. Get in there! That guy's coming for him. Coming for Barrett. Oh, I didn't even see the other guy. Oh, and you're staggered. Very nice. Alright, Braver it is. You ain't gonna get away. Nice. Better go tell Kyrie. Kyrie could definitely right. not have done that. So, uh, what about the mayor's other request? You know, the whole oh, yeah. take care of her thing? I mean, lying isn't the greatest, but she doesn't deserve that. Not yet, at least. <laughs> take care of the merc. Might as well rest here. Actually, can I even stay in these hotels? I should go see Johnny. Let's go see Johnny, just for old time's sake. Can't work there. Save your aching feet and ride a wheelie instead! Boom. This takes me back. Feels like so long ago that we did all this for the first time. Johnny Seaside is actually. It's changed so much. I almost If you come across any cool curios, you know where to bring it. Johnny's collection is uh, actually his. It's on Oh, okay, I'm just allowed to rest. Oh, look at all the choke of the plushies from the saucer. I don't know art, but I know what I like, and I like this. It looks a lot more filled in than last time. Well that part's pretty empty still. Yes. All right, thanks, Johnny. We'll take the long way. Oh, this, the save crystal. Old school. I want that in real life. It's changed so much. I almost did Glad I was able to see these pieces in person. <laughs> they love the. Johnny's Everyone loves hey, the collectibles. An orb or two? Case? 
I'm gonna go tell the mayor so I can claim my reward. Hold it. Hmm? The mayor had another request. Uh, uh, what was it? Said we should take care of you. He what? No, this has to be a joke, right? Hate to break it to you, Kyrie, but this is no laughing matter. <laughs> Wait, hang on a sec, please. Why would he ask you, my own business partner, to take me out? What did I do wrong? <laughs> um, <laughs> all of these things. <laughs> Once you showed up, I knew you'd handle it better than me, so I thought I should let the pro do his thing. And if I hadn't shown up, what then? I mean, I would have figured something out. I'm actually a surprisingly resourceful gal, you know. Do you want to die? <laughs> <laughs> Forgive my granddaughter her questionable sense of humor. Wait, is that... Uh, Grandma? That... Wait, did we know they were related? I was taking some time off to enjoy the sun I don't when think I we heard did. a merc was in town. Figured I'd pay him a visit and, well... <laughs> the angel of the if slums, Cloud right? If come to your rescue, young lady, you would have been a goner. <sighs> don't be fooled. That mayor's no model citizen. He's as wicked as they come. You need to pick your targets with care. Yeah, yeah, he's told me a thousand times. Make it a thousand and one, because you still don't get it. <laughs> Look, I'm doing my best out here, okay? It's just that some things are beyond my control. You're the one who doesn't get it. No matter what I try every single time, it's... I wouldn't do that if I were you. Oh, Kyrie. You know I only want what's best for you. And if you're to be the next guardian angel of the slums... Honestly, I kind of get where Kyrie is coming from here. Parents want kids to listen to them because they know what's best, but they don't. They just want us to do whatever they tell us. And that really, really sucks, you know? Mm. <sighs> I've always looked up to the guardian angel of the slums. But that's your thing, Grandma, not mine. And no matter how much I want to follow in your footsteps and make you proud, I can't. Because I'm not you. I'm me. <laughs> I don't know. You certainly sound just like me. Oh? Oh. Forgive me, dear. I know I shouldn't push you. Or nitpick your technique. So how about this? We work together as partners. Equals. Sound fair? <sighs> now then. Shall we head home? The people need us. Okay, let's go. <laughs> In any case, thanks for looking out for my little Merc. I'll be taking her back to Midgar. Try to make sure she stays there. <laughs> Trying's about. <laughs> Thank you for stepping in. <sighs> I was just so pissed I had to say something. <laughs> Stay strong. You too. Girl power and all that. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, partner. Coming! Actually, let's say we look for one last job before we leave. Oh, I've got an idea. You see, I dug up a little dirt about that man. <laughs> okay. Just a little. <laughs> so, what do we do now? We go and tell the mayor we took care of the Merc, just like you wanted. Well, we did. I'm excited for the third game. Um, going to Wutai and meeting Yuffie's dad and doing all the pagoda stuff. There's a lot of cool stuff that happens in Wu Tang. Oh, there you 
are friends. I would have preferred a more as a token of my... Sir, we've got trouble. See for yourself. They even found the secret safe. It's... Oh my god. What? That was fast. You better head back. <laughs> We hereby bequeath your ill-gotten gains to the more deserving masses. And it's signed, the first and third guardian angels of the slums. Radiant saviors of the sun-kissed. No way! <laughs> you go, girls! Okay, Yuffie's at max happy now. Are we all? Yeah, everyone's maxed out. Just in the nick of time. Oh, there's another quest here. Wait, wait a minute. I don't see it on the board, actually. This notice board, okay. Back to the saucer. Where even is the notice board here? Uh, I don't remember seeing it ever. The map confuses me. No, no, no. Okay, look at this, and then... Oh, I think I saw it. I'm trying to... Oh, was it near the hotel? Where the... Where in the F? The words... This doesn't really help me. Is this me? Maybe the events were? No. Not there. <laughs> so confused. I'm so confused. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I never saw the notice board here. Oh, it's in Coral Prison. Okay. That's why I'm confused. <sighs> that makes sense. See what we got. Oh. Oh. We can just go talk to the person. Oh, is it just gonna be more like fighting stuff? Oh. Uh, Leslie, right? Guy from Corneos. Leslie. 
got his necklace. What are you doing out here? You look like you've been through hell. Got wind my girl might be out this way. Oh. Had to follow up. See if there was truth to it. In case I didn't tell you, her name's Merle. Why do they all I have names like Marl, Marlene, Merle? Hoped one of her friends and the would know something. Angel of the Slums also Shouldn't had a weird name like that. Even if they did have info, they're not dumb. They wouldn't dare blab to a former Corneo crony. But I was able to find out she wasn't in Midgar anymore. And ever since then, I've been moving from town to town, looking for leads. Sector 7 is still a mess. Probably gonna stay that way for a while. Expressway collapsed right after the plate. Then out of the blue, the company decides it needs a new president. Seems pretty clear Shinra doesn't give a shit about Sector 7. Undercity especially. But that shouldn't come as a surprise. The people have stepped up though. Clearing the rubble, helping the injured, locating the missing. Well, you saw. After the plate fell, the trio opened the place to refugees. The town tripled in size. Man, if you thought it was lively before. Mm. Unfortunately, when Corneo pulled up stakes, he took all that Shinra money with him. Oh, shit. I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. Walmart's days are numbered. Madam M's trying to work her magic, but... I don't know. So the thing is... Gus is running a special competition, it. and a woman is the prize. Wow, that's so fucked. Word around the Dust Bowl is she fled here from Midgar. It's just a hunch, but I think she might be who I'm looking for. She's a prize? That's sick. Gus is a real piece of shit, to put it mildly. You do that? <laughs> Monsters did. Gus is calling it a party, but it's an excuse to see blood. Lots of it. He pits people against fiends, and his money's on the ladder. I lost. So this is where you guys come in. Join the party, win, and free that woman. Hmm. Still a merc, aren't you? No reason not to. True. Please. We'll do it. <laughs> so you know, need a team of five to sign up. Team of five? Right now, it's one on oh, one. Oh fuck, okay. <laughs> and humans only, I'm afraid. <sighs> oh. <laughs> I'm counting on you. And so is the woman. If anyone can put Gus in his place, it's Walmart, it's reigning champs. Join Gus's party. Is it under? Yeah. Okay, well, let's do it. Ninja versus winged ones. Ooh, okay. Uh, I don't know what kind of materia we got, but... Oh, the Jester. That's a card. I haven't seen that enemy yet. Woo! Y'all ready for the party of your lives? Today's challenges are... Champion of Chocobos, the racing ace himself, Cloud the Knife, and Rude! Okay, this music Bring is too on, good. Versus my personal pick of the fiercest, most ferocious fiends you have ever seen! This is it, folks. You're about 
about to witness a brutal bloodbath of untold proportions. Let the shit hit the fan! Fuck. Um. Only Cloud has a sass. Maybe Yuffie. But, uh. Okay, ice. Can't be used. Oh, fuck. No, we're done. Oh, very close to being done. Yeah. Okay. Laughing at me. Let's um. Let's get some cure on us. I wish there was some way to edit our materia in that menu. Yeah, we got nothing. We got nothing on her. So ice was the ice was the material, I think. Sort of magic barrier. Well, that would be over here. Wait, would it? Magnify warding. Do I have gravity? I don't know if I do. Gravity. Okay, so what we're gonna do. Gravity with warding. Oh, it doesn't work. It would be elemental. Yeah, so I want this. Does that work? No, it doesn't work. Is there any way to prevent...
So there's no point to really have that. I will give her cure. Wait, there is some kind of, um, hang on a second. Okay. Oh, we don't have it leveled up. Oh, it's so close, though. Um, what is the difference between Shell and Mana Ward? And also, what's the difference between Protect and Barrier? I'm actually going to put item economizer on her. Is that the one? Or this. I'll do that one. So it's easier for me to heal. Disempowerment. That could be good. Uh, she doesn't have cure yet. But I'm going to maybe be using items mostly. Okay, we definitely have to do this, too. Um... Okay, Yuffie. Let's try again. Right, I can't use items. Okay, so I'm just gonna be curing. So some of those material choices were not the best, but okay. Fucking awesome. It was ice, right? Yeah, okay. Increase magic defense. What you gonna do about this? Wait, why did that do so much? Oh god. 
god. Look at that black hole. Riddle. Why didn't that work? I tried, my precious. I really did. Wow, that was fucked. I'll try again. I might uh, come back to this. But it's the last quest. It's the last quest. Why did that suck so bad? No! Alright, well that was just a fail. Music is so jazzy, I love it. Pizza cake. Okay, I need to back out of this probably to get my materia in order. Also, it's gonna oh, so it's gonna be fireballs? That sounds like bombs. Bombs? I don't know if they had a weakness. Let's look at Aerith's materia though, because it's been a while. Party hard with Aerith. Okay. Take this off for now. Okay, well, let's put this. No. Lightning and wind. Let's take back fire and ice. And now, what do we want? see what we got coming. I think it's gonna be bombs. Let's go with this for now and see. Oops, fuck. I want the party. Challengers are always welcome. You here to join the party? Okay. Gotta remember how to play Earth. 
Yeah, okay. Okay, inflict damage when they're breathing fire. Yeah. bigger when they swell. Okay, what's the approach? Hmm. Not that way. <laughs> okay, that worked. What happens? I'm wondering. How many? Okay, we had eight party members minus Sid and Vincent, minus Kate's at five. I'm wondering what happens if Aerith leaves our party after the temple. If that's the same? Because if it is, can we not do this later, you know? I'm gonna, yeah, okay, let's deal with our materia. Let's try again. I want Aerith to be... Um... Oh, she has fire and ice, right? I want her to be... This should be warding. Or oh, sorry, uh, yeah. What? No, that's not what I want. That doesn't work with fire. So... Oh no, elemental, is that the one? Yes. Halves linked elemental damage, so that will half fire damage. I think I'm still going to be needing to do a lot of magic attacks, though, because that seemed to be doing well. Uh, let's... Let's put wind and lightning back on her, I guess. And... Some kind of barrier. Oh, we need healing. We're not going to be able to revive herself, so... Some kind of barrier. Like what Yuffie just had. Um, this one.
I'm wondering. Thinking about this ATB activation thing. Cause she needs ATB like pretty bad. It's hard to it's slow to get with her. So maybe I could try this. But yeah, let's try that. It's cool, it's forcing you to use other characters. Or all the characters. Except for Red. Okay. The shield was good, but... It stays in one spot, which makes it hard to use. So we're just gonna try and buff her up. I'm just gonna have to block these things, fuck me. And, um... Use okay, here we go. Protect this one. I gotcha. It's fine. I'm okay. Go on. What do we do? Don't give up now, you guys! It's really hard to stay in one place with these guys. Fuck, man. They're just relentless. fucking damage to these guys. Stop it. You'll see. I really want to get my familiar out, but... Okay, that's better. Stop it. Why are you guys doing this? It's non-stop! I literally can't catch a break! What the? Can you guys stop alternating perfectly? Let's hope Aerith doesn't leave the party. Because we're leaving. <laughs> we're leaving. Which sucks because I want to see that. I want to see his girl be saved, but. You we made it. no progress there. So. That's our last remaining quest, I think.
which sucks, but we're we got we gotta save the world, Leslie. We gotta save the world, dude. Oh, I see we're at two hours. Shit. Okay. All right. This will happen in the next video then. <laughs> I don't have a quest for the ocean. No. Okay. Yeah. Couldn't save Leslie's girl today, but... Did I just save? No. Okay. So we will stop here and in the next one... We're doing either proto-relic in the ocean stuff or story stuff and heading to the temple. So that's pretty exciting. So I will see you there. Thank you so much for watching. <laughs>